Well, here's a question for you, Trent. Have you ever set water on fire? No. All right, well, we're going to kind of do that today. We're not really going to set the water on fire, but it's going to look like we are. And in order to do that, we're going to use a chemical that we've used once this year before. We used calcium carbide. Do you remember what we used this for? For the pumpkin explosion. Blowing up pumpkins, right? So we know that this can produce some pretty spectacular results. Uh, calcium carbide, when it gets wet, it makes a gas called acetylene. And it's a very flammable gas. So obviously, you know, if we dump some in a beaker of water, we're going to make some of that gas. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to put a little scoop in here, just a few of these little, they're just little gray chunks, lumps of calcium carbide. We're going to put a few of those in. It's going to make some gas, and I'm just going to have you light it with your lighter there. And it's going to look like we are setting our water on fire. Okay, so we'll put this in. And all you want to do is just kind of put that lighter carefully and light it. But let's get our goggles on first, um, just in case anything flares up more than we want it to. All right, we're ready. I'm going to add the calcium carbide. Give it just a minute. Now go ahead and light it. All right, so flaming water. Pretty cool stuff, huh? And it'll kind of burn as that gas is being produced. It'll burn off. And we actually, you know, burning off that acetylene gas as it's produced.